Hi Future Engineers! I'm Engineer Ray Mart Bonete, also known as Engineer Prof. PH, a mechanical engineer, educator, and a content creator. In this video, we are going to learn on how to utilize Casio FX570 ES Plus 2nd Edition in solving problems in thermodynamics, a mechanical engineering subject. Calculate the change in enthalpy as 2 kg of nitrogen is heated from 1000 Kelvin to 1600 Kelvin. Assuming that nitrogen is an ideal gas at a constant pressure. The temperature dependent specific heat of nitrogen is Cp is equal to 39.06 minus 512.79 T raised to negative 1.5 plus 1072.7 T raised to negative 2 minus 820.4 T raised to negative 3. The specific heat at constant pressure is in kilojoules per kilomole Kelvin and temperature is in Kelvin. From the concept that Cp is equal to the derivative of enthalpy with respect to temperature, the differential equation can be transformed to derivative of enthalpy is equal to Cp times the derivative of temperature. Now we can solve for the enthalpy or change of enthalpy by integrating the equation and substituting the temperature dependent specific heat of nitrogen. Applying the limits to make it a definite integral, we have the definite integral of derivative of enthalpy from H1 to H2 is equal to the definite integral of the derivative of temperature from temperature 1 to temperature 2. Next, substitute all the given in the problem so we can easily solve or evaluate this integral using Casio FX 570 ES Plus, second edition. First, press mode 1. Then input the integral. Press integral. Then substitute the given data. Apply the temperature limits from 1000 Kelvin to 1600 Kelvin. Then input the value for the specific heat at constant pressure. Since Cp is in kilojoules per kilomole Kelvin, the resulting value is in kilojoules per kilomole. So 39.06 minus 512.79 T raised to negative 1.5. But we will let the temperature as x. 512. 0.79 alpha x raised to negative 1.5 plus 1072.7 t raised to negative 2. So alpha x raised to negative 2. minus 820.4 alpha x raised to negative 3. Then don't forget to put the closed parenthesis. Then press equal. The resulting value is in kilojoules per kilomole. So this is 23,429.6 kilojoules per kilomole. To get the specific change of enthalpy of nitrogen, divide this by the molecular weight of nitrogen which is 28 kilograms per kilomole. Finally, to get the change in enthalpy for 2 kg of nitrogen, multiply this specific change of enthalpy by its mass. Therefore, the change in enthalpy is 1,673.54 kJ. That's it for today's video. I hope that you learned on how to utilize your Casio FX 570 Extra 2nd Edition. See you on our next video.